Putting hogs on the mob, planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body, old school for low. Purple rim, 77 cutty, black with the purple strip. What's good, Ravens fam? So, <clears throat> Adam Scheffler tweeted out. Chief Offensive Coordinator Eric Ebony, I probably said his last name wrong. I already know. I'm not the only one. I'm not, I'm not the only one that says his last name wrong. But anyway, has been requested to interview for the Ravens Offensive Coordinator job. For sources, Ebony also remains under consideration for the Colts head coach job that he has interviewed for and the Titans Offensive Coordinator job, amongst other situations. Now, also with that, uh, the Commanders have, uh, is, is wanting an offensive coordinator, and they want to talk to Eric Embiddy as well. Also, the Jets want to talk to him as well. That's a lot of teams. That is a lot of teams. Um, I would love, obviously, I would love for him to be – the Ravens offensive coordinator. But if he gets a uh, head coaching job, shout out to him because he should have been had a head coaching job for the work he has done. Also, that the um, request for the interviewing for that, I wonder if Lamar put in a little word, you know what I'm saying? Saying uh, he wants that because uh, he has the power. Like, if the Ravens are stupid enough to let Lamar go, Oh, psh, they going downhill. Everybody going to be laughing at they, but even me. But um, I like that. Uh, I believe, how many championships has this man went to? What, five? Four or five uh, championships? Uh, uh, man, um, how many, I think how many Super Bowl? I already know he won. He's a Super Bowl winning offensive coordinator. So the the, the right is on is on the wall for him, but what he could do for the Ravens, and they getting uh, some hopefully some good wide receiving courts. Uh, we just need a new room. Uh, obviously Bateman stays. Uh, I don't even know what do uh, Dev, uh, even my boy Proche. I, I I don't know. It's 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 so many questions on that that room. This draft, I've seen, seen, I've seen some of you all put in the uh, community chat, text thing, whatever it is on YouTube, what you would like um, for as the draft or, the, or what the Ravens, what you wish the Ravens would draft for as wide receiver. And with Eric, that's literally wide receiver, like wide receiver core. With Eric Ebony as a offensive coordinator, his creativity of getting people open with the skill set of Lamar Jackson with that arm and legs, man, man. But I feel like if that was to happen, it might be that uh, Gary Kubiak, Gary Kubiak situation where he's here, he's gone. He wins the Super Bowl with someone else. That that might happen. But the chances of us, I already know some people going to probably put in the comments. If you even reach to this far of the video, man, there ain't no way y'all can get here. There ain't no way. Man, y'all lose your mind. You going to get here. Uh, that, that, that's, what I, that's what I hear. That's what I hear. That's what I see when I read some of them comments. Anyway, it's a chance. If Greg Roman can sit there and be the highest paid offensive coordinator, why Eric can't? Money talks. If he if he unfortunately is unable to get the head coaching job with the Colts, and that treat that team is trash, so man. But they get, I know it's all the other teams I named. Ravens Ravens choked that money up. You gave that little sorry Greg Roman all that money. Shoot, you can pay Eric got a lot more money. He got his resume is looking good. Super Bowl and all them dang championships. The only thing Greg Roman got is what Russian? Russian yards? The most Russian yards in the season? No Super Bowls throughout his whole career. No Super Bowls. 
Oh, but he got it up here. No Super Bowls. He didn't win it. If you don't win it, it don't count. But anyway, so let's just keep out a lookout uh, on this because it's going to be interesting. Hit the like, subscribe, hit the share. Everybody stay safe. God bless.